Welcome to a Market Matters update. Sean, last week the market closed above 5,500. You've lowered, you've lowered your cash positions to below 10% now and entered the market with about six or seven different stocks. Um, what are you seeing from here? Are you still bearish, um, as you've been talking about in the last few weeks? Um, I think for the last 16 weeks I've been looking for a pullback in the US markets. I've also been saying I wanted to see new highs in the Russell 2000, and we saw that last Tuesday. Since then, the Russell 2000 has actually fallen 1%. For people who aren't quite sure, the Russell 2000 is the small cap index in the US. So am I convinced that the market's going to fall from here? No, I'm always open-minded. As I've said before, you ought to play each individual situation by what you're looking at. So I'm not very, very bullish a market. I'm not leveraged long. I'm short calls against yeah. my long positions. The stocks I've bought are very individual situations. Yeah. Seven West Media, I think it looks fantastic on the charts technically. A sustainable yield above 6% fully franked. We bought it in the mid-190s, under, just under that, close at $2 today, happy as. Yeah. Um, Ansor, it's a very defensive stock. It's a stock I've been looking at for quite a few months now. It had a slight um, downgrade or update on its, what's going on going forward. Dropped a dollar from $20 down to under 19. We went long, down a few cents today, but I like it. I still think it looks fantastic. Um, what else have we been buying? Well, we've got Osminos in the portfolio, MTU, again, Definite takeover potential there. Suncorp as well. And Suncorp, Suncorp's been there for a long time. MTU closed today, 603, 604, hit 605. That's almost breaking out. So the stocks we're in look fantastic. What didn't look good today was CBA. Yep. It's in the news, in the news about lots of regulation issues. I got hit hard today, whatever, 50 cents. That's where everybody's long. So I'm a bit nervous about the stocks that everybody are long, as I said before. Fortescue got hit hard today. Have a look at the morning report. Not that happy about iron ore still. So I like individual situation stocks. I've got no problem holding them. Yep. To go out and buy the index here and say, do I think the next 150 points of the index is up or down? Well, my gut feel says still down, but it's not happening yet. Let's not kid ourselves. It's not happening yet. So when I get a buy opportunity in a stock, I get a trigger in a stock, I'll take it. And I've been saying that for weeks and weeks and weeks. Be patient. But when you get that opportunity, take it. And the best one, of course, is Flight Center. Yep. Flight Center, we're making $3 already. Love it. So buy the right stocks. Don't pull back. Awesome. Thanks for that, Sean. And everyone, please watch the ASX website tomorrow for the uh, investor update, which Sean features in for the month of July. Thank you. Thank you.